Alright, but yes, what is up, everyone? I hope you everyone had a happy 4th of July. Uh, it is me, Mr. Vids, along with my co-host once again, Joey Jojo. What is up, Joey? Hello, everyone. I hope everyone had a good 4th. Hell yeah. Playing more Grand Theft Auto 3. Hell yeah. On the PCS X2. Nice. D-Man, what is up? D-Man, yes. We are so back. Alright. Now for the next uh, mission, the chaperone. The fellas need to talk business. All right. I'm look after my girl for the evening. Hey, Maria, move your butt. Wow, what a ladies, Her man. This every <laughs> and here she is, the one and only queen of sheep. Yeah. Fancy pre-steam, yeah, pre-stream. I do too. I bet it cost me money. I mean, sometimes I'll play like some Medicare like theme music or who's that guy um that always has those uh pretty cool um custom songs that he does all the time. Ah. Uh, I... He like he makes fun of Vito. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, MC Jarbo. MC Jarbo, thank you. Uh, sub guys about to just eat got some cheese, about to eat and enjoy the show. Hell yeah, D man, glad you can come. Uh, same thing for Gassius. Think you can come along and watch. Hey, Gassius. Watch some two uh, goofballs uh, play some GTA. Richard, what's up, buddy? What's up, Richard? Right now, I got a chaperone this broad. You there, Joey? Yeah, I'm there. Can gotcha. you hear me? Oh, yeah, yeah, got you. There was a moment of silence. <laughs> oh, yeah. Happy 4th, yeah, happy 4th, everyone. Hope you all had a good day. <laughs> Xbox servers got hacked. Oof. Ugh. Oh, boy, that's... Is that the first time that's ever happened? Because I know PlayStation's uh, gotten hacked before. I think, yeah, it's the first time I'm hearing about it. Maria seems the type to know about all about stretching. Ah, Maria! Ay, ay, ay! <laughs> it's just that nobody cares. <laughs> I mean, it is Xbox. Yeah. I mean, PlayStation, Xbox, even Nintendo, like, it's, it's all fucking shit now. Got held for ransom a few days ago. Jeez. Holy shit. This bitch calling me what? Fido. <laughs> I can't beat Elden Ring, so I'm gonna hold your ransom until you tell me how. That is so fucking gay. <laughs> That'd be funny if they did did actually do that, and the devs were like, skill issue, get good. <laughs> I'd say Nintendo's doing pretty decent, they've recovered well from the Wii U, but that, that doesn't say, well yeah, it's like, it's not saying much. And just yeah, like, they're... It, it, Nintendo in general, like their lawyers, like the legal side of it, nah, fuck Nintendo. <laughs> I like their games, I don't like them as a company, if that yep. makes sense. That does make sense. Alright, Fido, you wait here and look after the club. I, don't I have a name, you right? fucking broad. Publish an exploit from the online FromSoft servers. Oh, wow. Someone was salty, they couldn't They couldn't get to the Elden Tree, the Elden Erden Tree or whatever. Speaking of which, I need to play Elden Ring. I'll probably play some more tomorrow. Oh, you know what that means, though, uh, with the Switch 2? That means everyone's going to have to buy all the old games again. Actually, they said that um, uh, NSO will be transferred over to Switch 2, so they're not going to, um, they're not going to, you're not going to worry about uh, having to rebuy the virtual console stuff. I just love how it's just that NSO. police car pushed the cab driver out of the way. Can you hear the cab driver <laughs> going, hey, get out of the way! <laughs> <laughs> sa, sa, you crashed into me, sa. Trump soft ransom because he didn't have his coup on. <laughs> Woo wee! Some party. I'll never forget that you... one. Oh, go ahead, go ahead. Did you see the glitches for the remastered version of this game? Yes. Oh, the, the fucking abysmal. I'm so happy I'm playing the PS2 version of this and not the fucking quote unquote remastered version. Fuck that shit. Yeah, they fucked up the code for the traffic, so everyone was just crashing into each other. It was funny. And if you like, I think it's GTA 3 
uh, specifically, if you were to, like, in the car right now and you start swerving back and forth, your car gets, like, big. Yeah. And yeah, Richard, yeah, the Switch exclusives are really good. I, I gotta give it that. Did a few videos about the remasters. Matt Mc... Oh, Matt McMuscles. You wanna know a fun fact about Matt McMuscles? Let's hear it. Uh, he was blocked by a Japanese porn star on Twitter because he wouldn't stop perving on her. Might as well start calling him Master Roshi. Yeah! <laughs> an insult to Master Roshi. Yeah. yeah. What was I going to say while well, with all the guns going on, really going on at that party? I was like, I it reminds me of um the like one that. guy, the one contestant on uh, Family Feud where the question was, what can kill a lively party? And the guy goes, a gun? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's not fucking wrong. <laughs> How many times has that happened to you, Joey? Uh, not at all, Gassius. The only people that have me blocked on Twitter are like Ethan Ralph and Dick Masterson. I got blocked, yeah, by Dick Masterson. I got blocked by Leave Vito so and Ethan minute. Ralph. Yeah, Vito has me blocked. I mean, that's a plus, right? We don't know where. And they seem oh, yeah, I don't watch Maximilian Dude, Richard. I see his thumbnails all the time because I watch, try to watch, like, videos about, like, fighting games and shit. I'm always seeing, it's like the same generic, like, gaping mouth thumbnail, so I'm like, no, nah, I'm not watching that. <laughs> what can kill a lively party? Bringing up the Jaguar. True? True. <laughs> you guys know that the Jaguar CD only had, like, 20 games for it? And then the party stops. <laughs> the screeching noise. <laughs> I brought my Jaguar CD. We could play, um, cyber tanks today. <laughs> Where did you learn to fly? <laughs> Where did you learn to be an asshole? Ah, just about to say that. <laughs> Maximilian's dog got KO'd. Oh, that's not funny. You know, he, uh, uh Maximil... I was about to say, Maximilian uh, dude... Oops, oops. <laughs> <laughs> we keep cutting each other off. Um, Maximilian dude, he actually worked on, um, the Killer Instinct remake or remaster, reboot. That one for the Xbox One. And one of the outfits for the werewolf is based off his dog. Shit. Yeah. Well, what were you about to say? Sorry about that. I was about that. to say, uh, who's that guy that uh, killed uh, Andy Worsky's dog? I Ian Miles Chong? Yeah, I was about to say, did Ian Miles Chong do it? <laughs> Flashbanged a dog to death. Yeah, now he gets to play, like, a far-right uh, dissident wannabe. It's like, dude, stop talking about American politics. You live in Malaysia. Still needs to pay for the pupper. Yep. Yeah, he will be when his government fucking captures him. Mm -hmm. Alright, buddy. Hurry up, hurry up. Oh, I forgot, I can't, um... Can't be too close to him? I forgot. <laughs> the spook meter. Ooh. Spook meter? I think you get that when you go to the wrong neighborhood. I was about to the say, guy um, as, as bad as we might have it, you know, in our life, Joey, you know, at least we can all say right now, at least we don't have a Category 5 hurricane coming our way. Oh, God, did, yeah, I was about to say, did you see Ethan Ralph stream the other? He gets this big stream where he's going to interview Nick Ricada and all, and he spends it in a fucking hotel room with shitty Wi-Fi getting high and drunk. He, uh, he sounded so fucked up. Uh, 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 He's like, and, and you know, uh, you're gonna have to talk about uh, your kids and shit and stuff, Nick Ricardo. Oh my god. Like, way to fucking drop what the ball. <laughs> yeah, oh, he dropped it. It's that Sonichu curse. <laughs> fucking, he abandoned his cats and his metal shack and fucking Merida just to hide out in the hotel during a fucking hurricane. Adding Ethan to GTA 6 as an NPC will be the best idea ever. Ha! You remember when someone leaked a good chunk of GTA 6 last year? I remember that. Yeah, it was like last year or the year before. Oh, that game's gonna... When that game comes out, it's gonna be like 200 gigs. Yep, and it's gonna need a day one patch, which is, a, you know... That extra 
amount of gigabytes, and it's going to be a buggy mess. You're going to have microtransactions. Mr. Big Mouth Shark Mr. cards. You know what goes on here is they used an Amazon Fire Stick to leak it. <laughs> Gotta love it. 500 gigs easy. Might be a Switch 2 early title. I'm pretty sure your Switch 2 would explode trying to play it. I'm pretty. I heard a rumor that the Switch 2 will be closer to like a PS4 Pro. Yeah, a GTA 6 is not fucking running on there. Did you see the Switch? Did you see the Switch port of Mortal Kombat 1? Jesus Christ! Pretty brutal. What's up, Torsh? Torsh. Spunk and chunk. Time to whack Curly Bob. Whack Curly Bob. Sounds like a euphemism. Yeah. Whack a guy, off a guy, whack off a guy, because I'm married. <laughs> I was about to say, um, shotgun versus car, T turns out car wins. <laughs> he just stood there shooting at your car. Troll and I for the Switch, which is probably the worst Switch port ever. Jesus. Wankers. Wanks. <laughs> Roberto. <laughs> Supposed to be published by Square Enix, but they gave it to a company related to Game Mill called Maximum. Ooh, yeah, Game Mill is not good. I have their Karate Kid games, and they're fucking awful. We're at war. The Triads have a fish factory as a front. Most of their business goes. I mean, this is Chinatown. Hyperbole. The NES Karate Kid game that LJN published is leagues better than the fucking new Cobra Kai games that came out. They are not good. That's funny. Some of their soldiers too. Ah, cool. I got some guys with me. Mr. Miyagi got graped. I think I did. Atlas developed Karate Kid. They also did Friday the 13th. Yeah, those are Atlas games. Mr. Miyagi's uh, karate skills couldn't help him this time. <laughs> you know, he was a comedian. I, I looked that up. Know. Pat Miorta. Yeah, uh, Pat Miorta was a comedian in the 50s. He called himself, and I am not making this up. This is not a lie. This is his words out of his mouth. He used to call himself the hip nip. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> blow in, blow out. Also worked on the NES port of Bonk and Panic Restaurant. That's Morita. Yeah, Pat Morita. Bonkers. <laughs> So I guess I gotta cap some triads. All right, bust some caps. Eat lead. Shadow of the Ninja. That is a good game. They're remaking that. Tear into them. Oh God, they're trying to. Uh, introduce me to a baseball bat. Turns out, that's not working very well. Yeah, who, who would have thought? Bat versus machine gun. Get some, get some. Yeehaw. Natsume was a peak company. Yeah, they made wild... Was it Wild Arms or Wild Guns? Which, for the Super Nintendo, that was fucking incredible. I think Wild Arms was on, uh, PlayStation. Wild Arms is an RPG. Wild Guns. That's what I'm talking about. Ah, gotcha. That was a good one. We'll taunt you with a New York accent. They've been living there for a while. Hey, I'm walking here. I'm walking here, ass. Top game for the SNES. Made great games. Yeah, a lot of people just know them as the Harvest Moon people, but no, they got some... Uh, Pocky and Rocky, Wild Guns, um, ah, fuck, Ninja, I forget what it's called, Ninja, some, Ninja Saviors, for the, uh, Super Nintendo, they got a good list. I'm not familiar with that one. Ninja Warriors, thank you. I played Ninja Warriors on stream, that was a really good game. I had the, um, HD version that added two extra characters. Ooh, nice. I'm trying to find, a Triad. Pucky Sucky. 
It was a reskin Shadow of the Ninja. Oh, they did the Power Rangers movie game too? That's a great game. Uh, yeah, the Super Nintendo got a lot of really good Power Ranger games. I think uh, the person who did the music for the first Power Rangers game on SNES also did the music for Mega Man X3, and yeah, you can tell by listening to it. Uh, Power Rangers for the Super Nintendo is actually really fun. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna get my computer set up in a little bit, and I am definitely gonna stream that one. Hell yeah. I saw your library because of the... of, um, for Steam. Looks pretty good. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna get some more. They just put Killer7 on sale, so I'll probably pick that up. Hell yeah. Seven bucks for Killer7 is worth it. Especially since my GameCube copy doesn't want to fucking work anymore. Wamp, wamp. I'll probably try it again sometime in the future. But yeah, my GameCube copy, the, the, the second disc, doesn't work. Yeah, uh, I can only walk like a few feet in Almeida Town, and it's like, nope, no more. Oh, that sucks. Mega Man Gen X. Is that my? Yeah, I got. I can stream on my laptop. Just depends on the game, right? Yeah. Hades one on sale. Fun shit. I heard good things about that. Probably can um, stream. What's it called? Uh. Like GTA 5 <laughs> with it. I could probably get, I could probably do that if I play on low graphics. And I believe so I need upset. this truck here for the next mission where I have to go back to the factory and blow it up. Oh yeah, those Dragon Quest games are fucking expensive too. Four and five on the uh, DS. I was lucky to get eight when I did. It, it really pisses me off that um, Enix does or Square Enix doesn't want to put those games out on anything else. Because they only it's only one, two, and three. They're remaking one, two, and three, but it's like I want to play Dragon Quest eight on anything other than a 3D device. So I guess I they're fucking playing on my computer. Tumblr Hades fans are so insufferable. I mean, anything from Tumblr is a no go. Tumblr's not even around it. I mean, it is, but no one does it. Every, every website now is Tumblr. That's, that's, the, that's the cold, hard fucking black pill, if you call it that. It supposed to come out in America on the PS1, but it got canceled. Damn. That sucks. Fucking leeches who never played the game. Oh, yeah, those, those types of fans suck. Scalpers in general fucking blow. Oh, yeah. Kiwi Farms is not Tumblr. Uh, yeah. All right. Not every site, but, you know. I was being hyperbolic. Imagine I don't know if Josh we talk... Imagine Potter Boom hears about... Hears that. <laughs> Kiwi Farms is basically Tumblr. No, it's not Tumblr. No. Ooh, ooh. There's not enough cheese. Sure. <laughs> this isn't real cheese. Not from Europe. That's not real cheap. Speaking of um, Kiwi Farms, I think they're gonna get a hold of uh, the, the, the body cam. Rakeda's tape. Yes, I cannot wait. That's gonna be so good. Yeah, Nick Rakeda's uh, body cam footage. Oh, it's gonna be great. We're gonna have a blast with that one. Just like here with the oh. triads. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I bet you Nick Rakeda's sweating bullets. Ooh, Neko Kawaii European cheese. <laughs> you were doing great impression of Miss Viz during your uh, Slight Cooper stream, Joey. I need to rewatch that. <laughs> it wasn't. It was the turtle from Slight Cooper. <laughs> <laughs> Mod hack a little Samson and call it Little Rakeda. Entertaining, <laughs> nonetheless. Hey, Sly, find me a girlfriend, free girl. <laughs> Don't you mean a a boyfriend, free girl? <laughs> you sound just like Bentley. Ah! <laughs> At least Viz isn't crippled. Oh! <laughs> oh, ho, 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 ho. I love treats and vagina slime. I love dykes. Dykes! China! If I see a dick sly, I look away with a moment of being freaked out. 
<laughs> Bentley, what does this have to do with the mission? <laughs> the Japanese version of Sly 1 has an anime intro. Ooh, hell yeah. Neat. Bentley joined the crypt at the end of Sly Cooper. <laughs> I just want people to know what set I rap. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of impressions, uh, your uh, Josh Moon impression is like spot on. Uh. <laughs> uh, it's spot on. <laughs> we have Juju the cow, Jack Serrera, who's Jewish, who likes to get fucked wearing a cow costume. Which reminds and he's got me a Joey. conversation. Black feet, Ethan black Ralph. feet, black feet. <laughs> black feet? <laughs> black feet, black feet. Yeah, I think I'm gonna turn that off next stream. <laughs> I can barely hear what the characters are saying in the fucking story. I'm trying to listen to like the the fucking Sly Cooper story. All I hear is brown man with baby, brown man with baby, brown man with baby. <laughs> I saw that, Richard. Yo, there's foot. You know who I Show Speed is? Do you know who that is? Yes, he's uh, that real like real cringe streamer. Um, yeah, that was like, well, loud a black IR kid. Yes, does a lot of IRL shit. I think he was in fucking WrestleMania this year. He was in like Norwegian or Poland, dude. Like a crowd of people, fucking great. It looked like you know what it looked like. It looked like an uprising, third world country, and they just went into the dictator's fucking palace and yanked him out. <laughs> it looked like footage of fucking Gaddafi getting stabbed in the ass. Grabbing, um... <laughs> Except. Uh, with his, his fucking hair, and I guess some people were even spitting on him, like, what the fuck? Someone was selling his hair on fucking eBay. I show speed as the manner as a Ren and Stimpy character? <laughs> <laughs> you need to get, like, play the Ren and Stimpy music on, like, clips of him. Happy, happy, joy, joy, happy, happy, joy, joy, joy. <laughs> oh, thank you, Gassius. Yeah, I, I didn't use re- just, just, guys gotta learn the pattern. It's a rhythm. Zawada. <laughs> take that dick, take that dick, 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 <laughs> With that in mind, I think I might uh, hold it with uh, having text to chat. <laughs> yeah. Man holding baby, man holding. I'm trying to do a rhythm game, <laughs> and I hear Star of David, Star of David, Star of David, Star of David. <laughs> Speaking of um, impressions, uh, I saw a couple of Oni Plate clips uh, being shown in my recommendations. <laughs> and, and it was the one where uh, Chris is uh, impersonating Goofy. <laughs> it's the funniest Oh, shit. yeah. Sora, we gotta embrace the darkness. <laughs> we gotta embrace the darkness. <laughs> I was watching the one where they were talking about Hercules. And they kept trying to gaslight one of them into thinking that there was a little version of Hercules called Herculad. There is not. I have seen Hercules. There is not a little boy named Herculad. Yeah, he's in the movie. You just didn't notice him. He was in the background. A background character. They fully gaslit fucking um, uh, Zach into thinking that too. That was the funniest part. It's great. Okay, let's do this thing. I can set Crenson. this baby to detonate, but I Crenson still can't use moon these with these hands. Here, this rifle shot. Just have to memorize the pattern, right? Dick, take dick. <laughs> <laughs> trying to think, like, the only, like, impression I can really do is probably, like, Darker Claw. <laughs> but that's, like, so easy. <laughs> like a Frank Walker, yeah. <laughs> I'll get you. I like how that's literally also a sound wave voice, but they added like a filter over it. Yep. And a couple times during the show, you'll hear it, and I guess that's how they got the, the idea for Dr. Claw. Yeah. Excellent ravage. <laughs> <laughs> ah, so now we gotta blow up this, uh, here, boat. Cave of Wonders from Aladdin. Oh wow. Get a good vantage point. That's true. I'll head in when you fire the Take this, Claw. I'm always on duty. Do I'm good at uh, hanging out here. Do you remember the Is robot chicken skit with the with the Terminator and Inspector Gadget? Yes, that was great. 
That meddlesome twelve year old niece of his. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I can't think of, like, Inspector Gadget without thinking about, like, hanging out here with my good friend Inspector Gadget, and we're gonna play Minecraft. <laughs> you can shut up now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always on duty. <laughs> For a while, that was like, he, he wanted to bury that, that and he can't. It was almost lost media for a moment. Yeah, that and his Elmo review. Oh my god, that is like... Say what you will about Inspector Gadget, but that was like, you know, kind of, kind of funny. The Elmo thing was fucking cringe. Oh, it was awful. I showed it on stream. It's like edgy jokes, and that was it. But there's nothing wrong with edgy jokes, but he just, he, it's the delivery. Yep. Alright, time to go all snipey snipey. Stop, Inspector Gadget, the Amish are myth. <laughs> Funny Inspector Gadget video in Discord. Uh oh, if I can aim right. Oh, what the fuck? It won't let me zoom in. That's weird. Bug zooming mechanics. Yeah. Nothing you can do. What the fuck, man? Big tough Yankee boy? The big tough Yankee boy? Oh, did you fail the mission? Yeah, unfortunately. Failure. Oh, is that like not working? <laughs> fuck. That's weird. The zoom in. Nothing you can do. There's nothing I can do, man. I, st I can be good at video games if I want to. Snort. Big tough Yankee boy, and I have no ammo. What the fuck? Gotta go to ammunition. Well, shizzed it. Would fail the mission, go back and do it again because showing his hands is not an option. <laughs> I'm not rewinding. Yo, it's rewind not anymore. Time. Rewind time. Unless it's like a, unless it's like something like a Kaizo Mario game or Super Mario Brothers 2, the Lost Levels, which is an official Kaizo Mario game. I'm not really using rewind. <laughs> That's weird though. Um, it's not letting me zoom in. That is weird. It, wasn't it like the R3 and R3 and L3? I think so. Try the uh, trigger buttons. I am. L1, R1? Might, oh, it might be triangle. Try triangle and circle. Nope. Oh, ooh. Oh my god, why didn't it do it that time? I literally pressed those buttons I would, before. I would not abuse the re function of Mega Man 2. I saw that, Richard. Someone sold a, sold a PS5 dev kit as a PlayStation okay. pizza. Well, at least now I know how to zoom in. Alright. <laughs> Scratch right. that out of the way. Where did you learn to zoom? <laughs> where did you where did to zoom? Leo Pirate Stream? Oh shit, if you can uh, send the link, yeah. I got it. Hell yeah. There he is. Leo Pirate's pretty cool. Except for that time he was on that debate with PPP and Mr. Mediker. Ooh. Gamergate was the 9-11 of the internet. There we go. Kaboom. Kaboom. Raid time. Raid Shadow Legends. <laughs> oh my god. Bugged aiming mechanics, am I right? <laughs> Nothing you could do, dude. You were you were pushing buttons. Dealing with that online lag. God, it's fucking bullshit, man. Online. Only the shitty may apply. Uh, yeah, let me uh give a guys, shout there's so out much to stuff Leo. going on here. What a cluster. You got spells? Status. Sup, Leo. Leo oh, pirate. What, spells. I, perks. What are these perks, man? There's a lot. There's a lot going on. There we go. Rewind time. <laughs> it's their rewind. 
You did you did not play the game properly. You only cheated yourself. How dare you use the rewind function? Really? Right in front of my beautiful, delicious, delectable Susie. And if, at least for the most part, at least with these games, because I hate backtracking all the time, you know? Oh, that is a pain in the ass. I have no problem with it. Yeah, especially for that. That was one of the few things the remastered actually did good. They allowed you to... They had save points in the mission, and they allowed you to restart the mission right after fucking up. Here we go. Like, that's actually a good bonus. So sensitive with the analog stick. Oh, yeah. I think I did it, though. Got him! Got him! I see, yeah, Leo uh, hop on your chat from time to time. It's pretty cool. Yeah, he's pretty cool, dude. Uh, I got Leo in chat. King of Poles been in chat. Um, Mako Shark Time has been in sh uh, chat. She's pretty cool. She does videos about, like, internet people. Now, if we can get... Um, if we can get Medicare to, to hop in. <laughs> that, that's one big check. Chat. Shit. Buy a hat for your hat. <laughs> buy a hat for your hat. And bye bye ship. Bye bye ship. Gotta play that Felt shitty it. Titanic music. Woo, $150,000. <laughs> you better get that much for sinking a ship. Cartel cruiser. <laughs> I bet Salvatore Leone is going to be very happy with us and totally not going to back sub us in the back. Like the Italian Oh yeah, he's going to love he it. <laughs> kind of oh. sucks you can't have the music playing because that, that really is a big part of this game. Mm -hmm. Oh, especially for like Vice City and San Andreas. Oh god, yeah. Yeah, for Vice City. Wow, that cab flipped. <laughs> I was going to say, like, in my car acted like it was nothing. You just boom. You know, for not being New York City, it really does look like Brooklyn. Yeah. You just need, like, more people saying, Hey, I'm walking here. A couple more drive Walk in over here. They fall into the Yiddish tunnels. <laughs> some some certain tunnels, you know? <laughs> Non-specific tunnels. I mean, if you weren't red-pilled before, you should be after <laughs> seeing the fucking Hasidic <laughs> Jewish man <laughs> pop out of the fucking sewer like a fucking ninja turtle. Just one little job, and Salvatore Leon is going to make me a made man. You ask me on my day and my daughter's graduation from kindergarten. <laughs> that I cannot do. That like it has that stereotypical uh, Italian uh, mob boss music playing in the background. Yeah, it's like, oh, we watched Goodfellas and God just turn that into a video game. And then we watched Vice the City. show, specifically um, uh, Tony Pajama skits. Just Tony Pajama Tony skits. Tony Pajamas! <laughs> Tony! It's the Menendez brothers! They got tomatoes! <laughs> <laughs> or was it earlier because we were making, we were talking about what you played? Speaking of Kingdom Hearts, imagine uh, Kingdom Hearts, but it's with in GTA. Uh, that'd be funny as shit. I Tommy still need to stream. We need to defeat the darkness. <laughs> and he just looks at him. <laughs> <laughs> just, oh, it's Maria. The cause, a trap. Maria. I still need to stream Kingdom Hearts 3. That and the card game, but I don't want to fucking do the card game. Yeah, why have the card like, game? <laughs> it, honestly, it's a good game, uh, but it's kind of tedious setting the deck up, getting the. Uh, like a lot of grinding just to get things set, or...? A lot of- there's a lot of Uh, cause you need certain cards to open certain doors, and you'll almost always never have the cards. You have to grind out all f***ing enemies. And it's hard, too. Some of those bosses are bullshit. It took me like a year to fight- what was it? Replica- Replica Riku 2. He kicked my ass. 
This is a friend of mine. Okay, get the no fuck friends. off my screen. So good. What's so up, D man? Come on, Jeez. <laughs> the speeches. We better get out of here. Jeez. Get more hysterical it's a suka. Less friendly reunions. We're going on the island. The other one. <laughs> no, it's kind of amazing that Rockstar was able to pump out so many games that they did in the 2000s. And then, like, the 2010s to, like, the 2020s, they just stopped. It was GTA V, Red Dead Redemption 2, those dog shit remasters. That was really it. Like what, they ported Red Dead Redemption 1 on, like, modern consoles? Woo! Like Which Skyrim. I am sh <laughs> I'm shocked they didn't fuck that up. Uh, apparently it's a good port. It has the uh, Undead Nightmare, which I really like. Can you believe the Wii is almost 200? Or, tw it's almost 200! <laughs> it's, it's almost 20. Oh my god, you're right. Was it 2005 or 2006 it came out? Have to talk 2006. Uh, the Xbox 360 came out 2005, and the PS3 and Wii came out 2006. It's pronounced Aska, you doggo bimbo. My bad, my bad. <laughs> my bad. Sayonara, Salvatore. <laughs> Sayonara. Shadow the Hedgehog. Oh god, I tried to play Sonic Heroes the other day because I was like, game. Have it on the uh, GameCube. That game sucks. Hell yeah, Richard. Oh, it is awful. On the Wii at a friend's house during the 4th of July. Guitar Hero 3 is good shit. Yeah, they really. They really fucked themselves with Guitar Hero because they kept making them. Leaving Luigi's in about three hours' time. Make sure he doesn't reach his club alive. Meanwhile, Maria and I will catch up on old times. Oh, what is How she, she old times? You got a massager. That's not a massager. And it's not a massager. <laughs> I keep that thing on me all. Stay strapped or get clapped. Oh, jeez. Well, time to have some ever... fun with Salvatore. <laughs> you ever play Sonic Heroes vids? A long That's, time ago, I tried it once at my cousin's house. It was meh. It's not good. It, it is. It is not like sh I've said this before. Shadow the Hedgehog is a better game. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. In both games, you have to replay the same levels. But in Shadow the Hedgehog, you take different routes and do different shit. In uh, Sonic Heroes, you play the same 14 levels four fucking times. And the only thing different is how long the level is. <laughs> Jesus. And, like, you fight a different set of teams every few levels. Like, it, it, how, how it goes is Sonic is normal. Uh, the dark characters are hard. Amy and her friends are easy. And then you have, like, a fourth thing. Like, a fourth group of people. And their fucking shit is, like, little missions. Like, collect five keys. Don't get seen by an enemy or um something like some real tedious shit, right? Oh, it is fucking tedious. Oh my god. You know, I, I think I've said this story before. Um, twenty years ago, actually, twenty years ago, a little over twenty years ago, uh, my fifteenth birthday, I got two of the same game. So my brother-in-law returned his copy, and I was able to pick out one game. I had a choice between Ninja Gaiden for the X. Or Sonic Heroes. I picked Sonic Heroes. You poor, poor man. <laughs> I eventually ended up rectifying that. I got Ninja Gaiden Black, which is fucking incredible. Man, ooh, I would have smacked my silly from making that decision again. Some lady left her <clears throat> quote unquote back massager out. Oof. <laughs> Ew. Did you give it a sniff, Gaseous? Give it a. Sniff, sniff, sniff a Rooney. Scratch and sniff. <laughs> poor, poor bastard. Remember when that was the thing? The, the scratch yeah. and sniff? I remember that. I remember, uh, what, what movie was that? It was fucking... I think it was Rugrats. It was like a Rugrat. Yeah, it was a Rugrats movie that had a scratch and sniff card, and I had the scratch and sniff card. I never went, actually saw the movie. 
and you were supposed to like scratch it at certain times, and it was like it smells like pizza in this bar. It's like trash. <laughs> it's trash. Trash. I dropped my monster condom that I use for my Magnum Dawn. Boom. Easy. Awesome. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. It's real easy when they're just standing still and, you know, letting me shoot a freaking RPG at them. Yeah, the AI isn't this isn't really that good. They get better with each game. <laughs> yeah. Like, I'm amazed. Like, playing the this game and then playing San Andreas. Whoo! That San Andreas came out, like, three years after this. It's like, what a jump. With, a, with regards to, like, gameplay. That was a, that wasn't a jump. That was a leap. <laughs> Easy peasy, poop, poopy squeezy. <laughs> Easy peasy, poopy squeezy. Oh, I, I was like, I forgot. I was like, yeah, that's a beeper. I was like, I remember beepers. <laughs> do you ever, you, you ever think someone, one person in the world may still be using a beeper? I wouldn't be surprised. It's like when people still use typewriters or some shit like that. It's like, why? <laughs> <laughs> no, at least with typewriters, I can see it. It's a little archaic, but you can see why. A beeper, like, there's no fucking reason. They keep making these, or the, those um, Despicable Me movies, when will they ever stop? Never. As long as the, the cash cow As long as they keep making money. Right? Yeah. Understood. I heard they're going to make a new Shrek. Next year, we're getting a new Shrek. Death comes as pleasurable news. You I miss rotary killer. phones. They were Kino. I like that in a man. <laughs> ah, this is my brother, Kenji. Rotary phones. Just like Kenji. Always trying to play with my toys. Well, no. My police source indicates that the mafia I can see no reason to trust him. In a bid yeah. to track you down. We can and how? <laughs> until they are dealt with. Mm. Take out these spying fools and end this vendetta once and for all. Ah. Gotta take out the NSA. <laughs> well, Edward Snowden would be proud. It's funny how back in the day, um... No, no reservations, <laughs> just like Native Americans. <laughs> I can see no reservations and ha- <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if I can maybe jump up here instead of going right up to them. With my amazing aiming capabilities here. Aiming capabilities, and it's a fucking rocket launcher. Snipe. There we go. All right. I just hear Aim for the head. Go, uh, give me a good time. I like, <laughs> Not now, honey. I'm Love popping some heads. <laughs> there was a cheat you can do this game that actually causes the characters' heads to explode. It was awesome. Yep, and the limbs can fall off. I used to just snipe old the old ladies and watch. It was awesome. <laughs> That's brutal. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of brutal, I, I'm, I've been thinking about doing a manhunt stream when I'm done Sly Cooper. Uh, it's either gonna, it's either gonna be manhunt, uh, the Avengers game, or um, I think another Tomb Raider. Rocket launchers make things so much easier. Skadoosh. I've already played Manhunt before on stream. I just never finished it. Yeah, I, I really like Manhunt. It's actually one of my favorite Rockstar games. And it's a shame the sequel was uh, so censored. Oh, uh, there is an uncensored version. It is Yep, on PC. Yep. Uh, yeah, the Wii version's step down because you also have those shitty motion controls that were in everything. There we go. Shut. Riona Raider. Shh. Boom! Headshot. Oh my God. Like 
had to aim it just right. Tomb Raider Remaster introduced Joey to Riona. Manhunt is technically a stealth game. Yes, it is. It's essentially a stealth snuff film game. Pretty much, especially the second game. <laughs> it's it like it's like they made like a. Imagine they made like a stealth game where you play as Jason Voorhees. That's Manhunt. <laughs> Sounds about right. All right. No more being discreet. Rocket. <laughs> <laughs> the rocket's red glare. The NSA bursting in air. <laughs> Got him. Speaking of, since it's 4th of July, uh, I need to watch Team America World Police again soon. Oh, that movie's great. We were, uh, yeah, it was a D-Man was sharing the one song. <laughs> or the main song, and I was playing Fuck the yeah. of Kim Jong-un one. I'm <laughs> so... Won't we? So won't we? So won't we? And Chad, it's kind of <laughs> shiwi, but not weary. Poor little me. <laughs> that was a good movie. Yeah. Like Can't damn. believe you ever. Oh, you ahead. ever watched the Thunderbirds? Like the the show that movie was based on? I've seen it, and it's like holy crap. <laughs> it's pretty cool. It's like this family of people, and you have these fucking rad spaceships and cars. It's pretty cool. I'm trying to think, what's the other like uh, cartoon from the back that was pretty um cheesy? Clutch Cargo. Oh God, that is probably the cheapest looking cartoon I've ever seen. You can tell like Western animators didn't really give a shit about anime. When they had shit like Clutch Cargo. Oh, that was... I don't know what the fuck they were thinking. The only reason why I'm even familiar with Clutch Cargo is because of that whole um, Max Headroom incident where the guy hacked the station and he's like referencing one of the episodes. So I'm like, well, let me, let me try, let me give Clutch Cargo a try. Nope. <laughs> it's like no animation but their lip. It looks like a joke from a Spongebob episode. And they're actors. <laughs> oh yeah. Thunderbirds was one of my favorite cartoons. Yeah. I really would you call it a cartoon like a puppet show, but yeah, it was really cool. I had like the entire series on my on, on an old computer I had a while ago. Long time ago. Long time ago. <laughs> a long time ago. Team America is great shit. Yes, it is. And I have taken a little I love no, how I'm they shocked. shit on, they shit on Hollywood so boy, yeah. much in that movie. He's probably out in the oh, take a, they took a big Still greasy shit on it. Yeah. We're, we're the Film, Film Actors, Actors Guild. Guild. We can call us <laughs> fags. <laughs> <laughs> Matt Damon. Matt Damon! Can <laughs> you see the backstory of why they do that? Because his puppet looked fucking stupid. <laughs> <laughs> they went up to the... Because it was like a British guy interviewing. He goes, and this, I mean, look at his puppet. It looks fucking mentally retarded. And the men, and like the British guy's just laughing his fucking ass off. <laughs> the writers and CEOs, I hate everyone. There's going to be an animator strike soon, being led by Adam Conover. You mean the one that goes, oh. Adam ruin, er Adam ruins everything. That that Adam. Oh, that guy has a really punchable face. I don't know if you Adam others, ruins so. everything. Looks like oh, I'm sorry, Adam no. ruins. <laughs> Adam ruins everything. Looks like a progressive lesbian. That's that's a good way to look at it. I was gonna say I don't know if you hear. If there's some fucking dipshit uh, street racing. The street racing that's in the, the background. You got a yeah. Fast and Furious movie going on in your back. Like the, there's Let's like front. a like a area where they'll do like donuts and shit, and it's like so fucking annoying. When they do it like it, it's like one thing if it's like okay nine o'clock that's one thing, but if, when it's like two o'clock in the morning, could you fucking not? <laughs> yeah, could you just no? There are kids playing with fireworks a little bit ago. I got the uh, there's a guy at my work that lights them off like every weekend, and I got the yeah it was really nice like the actual like big fireworks. Reminder that during the Rider Strike Guild, Adam left a a picket to go to a local game site and freckle with an employee. What the? F what a freaking 
cunt. <laughs> they can get away with violence because they use puppets and animatronics and Thunderbirds. Yeah, I love how little wiggle room to get a, get away with serious shit in kid shows because like American like kid shows are really fucking like censor pussified. Happy. Oh, censor happy, pussified. Um, the one thing they would do, I remember like for Samurai Jack was, uh, they would just use like robots. So when Jack's slicing people up, it's like, oh, it's just robots. So it's it's not that graphic. So it's okay. Yeah, Ninja Turtles did the same thing. Has there been any good Western cartoon since 2011? Tell that the Curse of Cowardly Dog. But well, that was also like on a different channel. So like on a mainstream channel, and it was like in the it was it was like late 90s, early 2000s. It's time you met on then season four happened. happened. Here's a payment for the last little job he did for us. Smiling Friends has been really good. I am shocked. Very good. Yeah. But like, for like stuff like Curse of Cowardly Dog and Ed Eddie, you don't really see anything like that. No. There's the fucking street racer again. All right. One of the best shows ever made because how good and weird it is. Yeah, that was a great show. It was funny was um, when people were, were saying, like, oh, I was so scared of uh, Return of the Slab. And I thought that I, I didn't think for me, I wasn't scared. I thought that was like, the funniest, coolest shit ever. Yeah. Return the Slab. David Lynch mixed with Looney Tunes. That's a really good description. Heck. And I, I'm happy they finally got some closure with Samurai Jack. Yeah. You ever watch Gargoyles vids? Briefly. I unfortunately never got to see the whole thing. I wish I did. I, I watched a bunch of it as a kid. Really, really good show. You can tell Disney wanted to make their own version of Batman the Animated Series, though. Get to the phone in West Belleville Park. I always like how they're like, there's this big watershed thing, and then, like, you just see a bunch of shit trying to get. What do we got? Shit. The Scooby Doo crossover was shit. I yeah, I saw that. that. Yeah, I, I, I saw an ad for that. I was like, Surrealist comedy, do not fucking miss. Mix. Xana Xanatos did nothing wrong. Pay a man enough and he'll walk bare through, barefoot through hell. Yeah. That was from a fucking kid's show. That was um Jonathan Franks. A lot of the voice casts and gargoyles were from Star Trek. Hell yeah. John Dilworth got screwed over. They already had Darkwing Duck. That was another good show. Man, I, I really wish they'd do it. Uh, uh, ten years ago, they did DuckTales Remastered. Way Forward. Man, let, I really wish Way Forward would do, like, Darkwing Duck Remastered. Like, the Chippendales games remastered. That would be so fucking cool. If only. Yeah. Courage prequel involving his parents. Cartoon Network abandoned it. Wait for it. Thundercats Roar and Teen Titans. Yeah, now fuck Teen Titans Go. I don't get the fucking appeal of that show. It is dog shit. Yo, that Thundercats cartoon was a straight up fucking insult. Especially now, since the original part. series and the 2011 series are fucking good. Really wish the 2011 series could gone on a few more seasons. But Joey, Thundercats Roar is so progressive. I am so sick of that. Bean mouth cow art shit. And I know, you know what? A lot of people say, like, uh, I was thinking about, like, 90s cartoons didn't look like. Uh, they had their own style. 90s cartoons all look like a classy Supo rug shit That's what when you look at them. But at least they were entertaining. Yeah. Duckman was really good. You know, they made a Jumanji cartoon? I remember that. Well, I thought that was like a fever dream. <laughs> Bread ring pork meets dead wing cuck. Dead wing cuck? Oh, they are- how- they're doing a Gumby bean mouth cartoon. How the fuck are you gonna do Gumby and not have to be claymation? That's like the whole appeal of his fucking character. You just gotta get with the times, man. 
But yeah, Bean Mouth is fucking the most lazy form of right or of animation ever. It's like peak millennial soy shit. Mm. Bean Mouth animation, weed-esque writing. Ugh. You must be a Zuka's new errand boy. Can I just say? Uh, I'm gonna say this. Let's I am so it. glad. I am so glad more people hate Joss Whedon. I am so glad. Shut up, Wesley. <laughs> no matter what he posts, they'll always say that. I love it. No, that's someone else. I'm talking about the writer. Wasn't he? The guy who wrote Buffy. Oh. The the bald Canadian guy that wrote Buffy the Vampire Slayer and Firefly. Like back in the 2000s, he was untouchable. If you I... fucking criticized him and said, I... you'll you, you'd be attacked. But nowadays, was... I thought that was the same guy because they both have Josh as their name. No, that's Will Wheaton. You're talking about Will Wheaton. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, they're, when they're fucking pieces of shit, they kind of just merge together, you know? <laughs> yeah, it all just lumps together. Yeah. Like back in the day, you couldn't really criticize fucking uh, Wheaton. Now you can because he's a piece of shit and everyone knows it. <laughs> He couldn't be left alone with uh, the actress that played Dawn and Buffy. It was like a little girl. Oof. Buffy Schmuffy. Panther making him fun of him while at the same time the episode aired Panther's voice actor. Ow. Came out for Steven Universe. That show is gay propaganda. Oh, Steven Universe? Uh, Steven Universe is just a shit show. Uh, I've never watched an episode. All I know, it's like this little fat kid with a Jufro. He's constantly crying. And the woman who made the show used to do fucking gay porn of Ed, Ed, and Eddie. What and now you know. I Her wish name's I did, Rebecca though. Sugar. <laughs> Rebecca Sugar. Buffy Smuffy. The first few seasons were alright, but man. I'm trying to think. Oh, that cat. It was either Buffy the <laughs> Vampire Slayer or Angel, where um, Joel Heyman was in it. Angel was so fucking boring. Oh my god, his actor was so fucking boring. <laughs> Got him. Kaboom. It's just funny and makes fun of everyone. Steven Universe makes fun of in the worst way. Self-aware. Boom. Who's the one guy that he used to be an Encyclopedia Dramatica, like ad, an admin, and uh, he started making uh, commentary videos, and he ripped uh, Steven Universe a new asshole. E no, I know who you're talking easy about. Easy peasy. It yeah, easy peasy. I think. Yeah, that guy's pretty funny. And I flipped the car over. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, out of all the, the the cartoons with um with that beam animation, the only one I like, and Richard said shopping. it in the chat just now, is Gumball. It's a funny show. Us that one of our drivers is a, a yeah, I saw a few clips of it. It was, it was all right. Cop. He's more or less useless out of his car. And speaking of making so fun of, uh, the they're making fun of driver here. Making He's more or, or less useless without his car. That's some funny <laughs> shit. And I love yeah, driver. I love the I love the little references they do. Uh, true grime street cleaners. And speaking of true crime, I did get uh, Streets of uh, Streets of um, L.A. So uh, I'll nice. definitely try to do that once down the road. That game is that game is actually really fucking good. You'll be um, it came out I think a year before San Andreas. It came out like 2003. San Andreas came out in 2004, and it had a lot of really cool features like that um, Vice City didn't have. So you can people through cars you can i think jump out of cars while moving the world was a lot more detailed you can go in buildings it was really cool that's odd awesome. i remember the only time i remember seeing any gameplay was i was at my one cousin's house years ago it was, might have been around the same time when um the game came out and um i remember the one mission is you have to like kill a bunch of like like you're underground and you have to like get a bunch of skeletons or whatever yeah, like, I think I remember that. Yeah. Like they're undead or something? I forgot the premise because it's been so long. Boy, the cops are on me. <laughs> the moment I tapped the Jeez! Shot. That one cop just knocked the other one out of the way. 
You fucking pigs! Color dreams are the action 52 devs. Slow, sh slow mo shooting and good stop and frisking. But yeah, the hand to hand combat really good in true crime. And yeah, you'll you'll be doing that quite a bit. You have to do that to um, uh, kill the last boss. The last boss is really cool. I'm not gonna really spoil it much, but it's like really cool looking. Oh god. Oh no. No! How did I get busted? <laughs> Holy shit! They fucking got you. No! <laughs> Spread them. Oh, the cop died at least. He had a blast. <laughs> oh, rip weapons. That was the other thing about uh, GTA that sucked, is every time you died or got busted, oh, now you have to buy all the weapons again, which thankfully I, I, I got a shitload of cash, so it's not too bad. Yeah. If I use cheat codes, would that make Empty Hero cry? Cry? <laughs> no, the only thing that makes Empty Hero cry is when he can't gargle Susie's balls. <laughs> Susie? Susie, why don't you slurp, slurp, slurp my balls? The NES G.I. Joe games, those are really good. G.I. Joe. I always think of those sh uh, videos that were making fun of G.I. Joe. <laughs> or the dubs. Oh, yeah. Me, 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 Pork me, chop me, sandwiches. Me. <laughs> Holy shit! Ru the story was like Rush Hour in every Hong Kong. Yeah, it's a real shame they only made like... They made two true crime games, and then they made like a third game that wasn't called True Crime, but it was supposed to be. I forgot what it was called, but it was really good. I, I, think, I think it was called, uh, something Dog? I think I know which one like, you're... It, 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 not, it's not Kane and Lynch dog days, right? Oh god, no. Multiple endings, game was good, but man, they had a map size of Los Angeles with fucking nothing to do. The map size was Los Angeles. Oh my god, I remember this shit with the hydraulics. No. Uh -oh. Sleeping dogs, thank you. That's a good game, too. I'm gonna go grab some water. I'll be right back. <coughs> Maria and I have gone shopping. Sleeping doggos. Our source in the police has informed us that one of our drivers is a strangely animated undercover cop. He's more or less useless out of his car, so we've tagged it with a tracer. <laughs> Why'd you bleed. do it, sleeping doggy style? <laughs> I hope everyone's having a good night. Oops. Sorry, everybody. Wrong place, wrong time. And I'm back. Hell yeah. He didn't miss much, just a few pedestrians getting run over. Huh. I like how for uh, Tanner from Driver, they have him in a little flamboyant walk. It's the funniest shit. Yeah. There he goes. Do you have to destroy his car? Just shoot it with a rock? I do, but he, uh, by the time you get or by you get out of your car, oh my god, I can't do anything because they just. Sh Dude, the cops just fucked you up. Sorry, Mudahar, I gotta take your. I can't drive. <laughs> I'm not doing. Do you it. just get a, an immediate wand? Play old thing when you start the mission. The Jesus. Moment, the moment I tap his car, it's a four-star wanted level. Holy fuck! Look at this. Look at all these cops! <laughs> oh my god, they are on you like flies on shit. Holy... Holy shit, oh... <laughs> They're just, no. We got a demolition derby, this motherfucker. Twisted metal, this shit. Holy... 
Holy shit, and they got the SWAT team and everything. Holy fuck, I'm getting bump drafted. <laughs> I'm getting bump drafted more than a NASCAR driver at Talladega. Holy shit. Jesus Christ. Dr. Disrespect. Oh my god, you're right. <laughs> you need the banjo chase music for this. Dale Earnhardt ain't got no these cops. Oh, you're on fire. And they immediately flip my car over. What the fudge? <laughs> they are not playing around. And meanwhile, <laughs> this guy that I'm trying to get is like long gone. He's, he's out of here. Holy they're shit. Like, oh, they're like, arrest him. Arrest him. <laughs> 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 Holy shit, no mercy! <laughs> Jesus! Quick! Taxi driver is trying his best <laughs> to flee from your raft. I do not deserve this! Do not redeem taxi, sir! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> you think he spit on the cops' donuts or something? He had information that could lead to the arrest of Hillary Clinton. Yes! Oh, poor Claude. <laughs> he Jesus. shot himself in the back with a shotgun 12 times. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the cops are doing more damage than me. <laughs> you gotta use the cops against them. <laughs> it's like Team America. <laughs> yeah. At least you have this fucking bigger, heavy car now. That's true. Hopefully, I get Michael more. Michael Bay's. Help. Michael Bay's new movie looks amazing. <laughs> I love it. Oh, this is great. I do not deserve this. <laughs> All right, buddy. Here I come. Our law enforcement! Yeah, he flipped over! Yes! I like how he's running so flamboyantly. <laughs> oh my gosh, quit running me over, quit blowing me up! <laughs> oh no! Get him! It's this aim, is pandemonium! It keeps, it keeps aiming at everyone but the guy! <laughs> Get away from me! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh no! Thank God. Get him! With 37 health. Thank fucking Lord. Woo! <laughs> that is real that was something else. Oh, you did it! We love our cops. Our law enforcement. <laughs> the Israel founders are after you. Holy shit! That was the funniest shit ever. That was great. That was fucking great. <laughs> so many cars flipping. Cars just trying to fucking run me over. <laughs> it was like that. It was like that car chase scene in the Blues Brothers. Dude, you're right. <laughs> Except the cops got to me before I can make the donation to the uh, the, the, the school. You are on a mission from God. <laughs> Oh god! Clutched. <laughs> oh man. That was that was amazing. That was the most entertaining shit for just one mission. I was kinda of thinking for a moment there, maybe I should just say say I was like, nah dude, let's have fun with this shit. Let's, let's see how far this can go. And thank god I did it. Cause that was entertaining as hell. Uh, that's something I used to love doing was giving like the complete like wanted level all the way up and just seeing how long I could survive. Yep. Just going on a killing spree, blowing everyone up. <laughs> that was great. It, it reminds me of, um, if you ever played uh, Driver 2, you would have survivor mode. Yeah. And the, oh my god, the cops, the aggression would be cranked up to 11. It was the funniest shit ever.
and remind me mm -hmm. just like that. He tapped the guy's car! Get him, boys! <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh, that's a funny King of the Hill joke where Hank's trying to get arrested. So he's doing what he thinks are crimes, like going into a store with shoes to buy something. <laughs> and finally, he just taps the back of a cop's car and is immediately thrown into the slammer. <laughs> you ruined the bumper sticker to my daughter's school, jackass. I just want some tap and die and some WD-40. WD-40. All right, Mr. Kenji. My sister speaks highly of you, though I'm yet to be convinced that a guy Jin can offer anything but disappointment. Perhaps you could help deal with the situation mm. that has me at a disadvantage. Of course, failure has. I'm its glad y'all were entertained by that. A Yakuza Kanbu is Oh, that was hilarious. <laughs> He's a valued member of the family. That's Break making the highlight real. And get him to the dojo mm -hmm. for the point. Uh, yes, I can. Right. That's getting clipped. <laughs> Me, choppy, choppy. Your pee pee. <laughs> I remember <laughs> the Valvinus clip. I remember that shit. Uh, what was the mission? Da -da -da -da. Ah, so I have to get a one level, so. Alright. Hindsight, I should have got in a cop car. Yeah. Oh, here we are. Hey, Mr. Copy, I got some donuts for you. <laughs> some delicious donuts. Got these cheeseburgers, man. There we go. We break the car with the bomb. Hell yeah. <laughs> Bye, Piggy. My sister speaks highly of you. She said you, you ran around the cops and even a few <laughs> Taiwanese. I'll see you stop. I'll see you <laughs> It was like World War Three, I tell ya. Yeah, that was nuts. We, but looks like you're fucking driving around Silent Hill. I love that. Do you remember that mod that got found recently? Uh, for Vice City? No, what? It was uh, an old mod for the uh, Xbox version of GTA Vice City. Where you, um... Uh, pretty much you, uh, your character looks like uh, James Summerton. Oh, yeah, Jay, I remember sorry, that. sorry, James Sunderland, I'm sorry. Thunder. Yeah, I, I remember seeing that. I think Justin Wang talked. And they thought it was lost forever until some guy um, going to like a retro game store and got an Xbox with it built in. Huh. You are Rook Samu. <laughs> Hold on a second. Yeah. 10 4. Gotta do the cop lingo now. I forgot you can turn on the top lights and make everyone move, uh, move away. Or pull over. Uh, now how to get in here. The donut run. Oh god. Well, back to I immediately, <laughs> I immediately turn on, uh, get back to the stream to see you getting flipped over. Laugh track. Yes, thank you, Gaseous. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Donut run. <laughs> it's rewind time, boys and girls. Sips coffee. <laughs> I bring no honor. <laughs> Most dishonorable. I always think of that one guy from Black Ops uh, Zombies, Takio. Hmm. Let's see if I can do that again without flipping the car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
And leg it. Floor it. Pedal to the metal. <laughs> they could have at least fixed your fucking hood. Nah. That costs extra. I'm you. Yeah. It's, here that not gonna, it's not really gonna be. Guy. I'm warning you. <laughs> Warn me with what? Hmm. Alright everyone, let me in. Let, let me, me in. in! Let me in! <laughs> we both thought about it. Knock knock. Knocky knocky. Oh god. Alright, buddy. Oh yeah, I almost forgot this is the same area um, later on where you have to deal with the the spanked up madmen and they're trying to blow oh. you up. Yeah. <laughs> I got a present for you. <laughs> Come to daddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh that's yeah, that, that's uh, that's a fun one. You gonna do the PSP Grand Theft Auto games? Like, uh, Vice City Stories and Liberty City Stories? Yeah, yeah. I don't see why not. They're pretty good. Uh, surprisingly. Wasn't one of those games where DSP was, like, failing time and time again? And Medicare was, was, like, commentating, uh, commentating over it? That was a good one. DSP is trying... It was Liberty City Stories. DSP was trying to chase after a car. He survives his car exploding... Runs out in the traffic, only to be killed by the car he was chasing. That and there it is. <laughs> <laughs> that clip, um, specifically, uh, only plays mentioned. And it's nah, so nice. How he did, yeah, DSP finds a way. <laughs> How does he do it? Uh, DSP, uh, finds a way. Jeff wow, dude. <laughs> Boy, these uh, cops don't give up. Mm -mm. Chasing that feel like a student loan officer. Yep, you stay there. I'm gonna drive in here. <laughs> I don't touch nothing that hot. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> okay. Alright, Oof. Eggs of steel? Alright, buddy. Talk about Duke Nukem? I'll stream Duke Nukem. I already streamed that before. It's a good game. First off, gonna shoot these guys, blow their car up. Oh god, oh god, no. Oh no. Oh boy. Please tell me he's alive. <laughs> you alright in there? Oh my god, he did not die. Woo! Alright, time to get in the fucking. Oh my god, stop! Stop hitting me! <laughs> the shitty CGI game on an emulator. Hmm. <laughs> like bumper. Look, I don't touch nothing that, that hot. He went in that uh, pay and spray. Oh, it's a different car now. Okay, you're gonna go. Uh, I didn't see anything. I'd rather let a thousand guilty men go free than the chase out. No, I'm not. Uh, Eggs of Steel. Is it a pinball game?
金玉みたいな匂いするなこの野郎どのいちは He just said something in Japanese. I was like, uh huh. That's cool. Yeah. yeah, eggs and rice, number 42. <laughs> All right. Another mission down. I like how they all put their hands up in unison as I'm driving right by them. Yeah. Well, mission's done because we don't have to chase them anymore. I mean, he did kill half our force. <laughs> He's like Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> He's unstoppable. The man has no. He does not feel fear, remorse, pity, and he can't be stopped. I love how the logic,、um, when they were like, trying to explain it to Sarah Connor, like, oh, come on. He obviously had a bulletproof vest. That's why he was able to withstand that shotgun to the、it、chest. It's impossible to overestimate. But he's a cyborg. But he punched through the car window without breaking a sweat. He was on PCP, obviously. And I've never had the <laughs> yeah. Pay his the okay, well, then explain him hitting、uh, a wall at 90 miles an hour head on. <laughs> Needless to say, we He applied it directly to the forehead. To repay the debt that I owe him. Applied directly to the、you、forehead. Head on. The cause on this lip. <laughs> you ever see that Ventrilo harassment where the guy's just repeating that? I need to see this now. I think I played it on stream, but I'll play it again because it's fucking hysterical. There's a part like. One of the guys, and like, they're playing WoW together, and one of the guys, he can't like raise his voice because like, he lives with like his family. So you have him like angrily whispering at him, going, Fuck, dude, this is how I work. I don't want to hear you spamming shit and vent. Apply <laughs> directly、on. to the p- <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the names he has in the goddamn chat. There's like 20 fucking versions of head on. That's <laughs> fucking great. Ah, those are fucking great. Ventrilo harassment.、Uh, the best one、uh, for prank calls,、um, and these were、uh, public, it was part of like, the public access.、Mm. That, that oh, public.、Calls. And they、yes. were in Austin, Tess- in Texas specifically. And <laughs> the most. The one I remember specifically,、um, there w a s these two black guys, and they were talking about, yeah, it's the summer of 1997, man. That was a good summer. And <laughs> the guy that goes in the call, he's like, yeah, man, I remember the summer of 97. I was, it was raining that day. I, I went out and got naked. And the guy's like, whoa, whoa, whoa.、And、he's like trying to cut him off. And he's like, yeah, and I started whacking.、It. And he goes, hey, 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 good man. You can't fucking do that. <laughs> <laughs> we got ch- he's like, yo, man, we got children watching. And the guy that's prank calling goes, well, yeah, I masturbate with the children. And the guy's like, nah, fuck that shit. And he gets like real fucking pissed off. <laughs> Dude, th- there are so many fucking good,、um, the public access. That shit is so fucking. Ass- and the other good one was. <laughs> He calls up this one guy and he's like a big conspiracy theorist. And he's like, hey,、um, I actually want to know if you're familiar with the、uh, pinecone theory. And he's like, what's that? He's like, oh, that's where I shove a pinecone up your ass. <laughs> Man, you didn't see that coming. We call that the M. Night Shyamalan. <laughs> and the other one. It's the same guy, too. And he's like, hey,、uh, you like those little Debbie snack cakes? And he's like, yeah. And the guy goes, I'm still fucking her. <laughs> 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 and he always has、um, this accent that the host of the show that's getting pranked on, and he always goes, You're on the air. And someone took his fucking voice and kept looping it. So he goes, Hello, you're on the air. And all you hear from the other side is, You're on the air. You're on the air. <laughs> I love that. It was a really good. You know that one? <laughs> like, Oh, dude, fourth strand, fourth. <laughs> Leather belt. Oh, oh. Level 18. <laughs> Yo, dude, it's spamming shit in bed. It's not me! <laughs> It reminds me of Keemstar. I'm on blog TV with my fucking hands up. I'm not starting my fucking self. That is. That fucking sound clip is so good because back when Baked Alaska used to do i streams, people would spam him screaming the heart. Get off my As bed, loud as possible. Not Fent, or have you been? It only does it when you talk. <laughs> I, I got chills. I need to share、um, 
those Austin uh, prank call videos, because maybe that's something you yeah. can stream, because those are the funniest things ever. Oh, God. I, yeah, I need to do that. Uh, I'm going to download a set of uh, Ventrilo harassments and edit them. Play them on stream. <laughs> or what's the one where um, the guy, or what's it called, um, a psychic gets prank called? <laughs> <laughs> and, it's like, and it's like, what? Didn't he, he didn't see it coming? These prank calls? If he's a psychic. <laughs> <laughs> I love one where he goes, where the guy goes, yeah, what's up, my nigga? And the guy goes, honey, do you suck your daddy's dick with that mouth? <laughs> <laughs> and there's parts where, and I think the guy that was the fortune teller was, um, was kind of in on it because he kept would hang up like people that were like legit and he goes hey um can i get a a psychic reading and he's like he's like what this is not a mcdonald's this is not a bodega can i get a you can get a foot up your ass is what you can get <laughs> no nope, there was I one where was... with you, with you, your mother with that mouth <laughs> i was watching public access shit it was a um this fucking like goth chick hosted a heavy metal show and she would fuck with the people that asked her to play Limp Biscuit. <laughs> it's fucking great. Do you, what happened where, um, because it seemed like back in the day, Limp Biscuit was, was cool. And then it seemed like for a while, people just didn't like Fred Durst for some reason. Uh, that was Woodstock 99. A lot of people blame him for that. And it was everything else Fred Durst. But he got the blame for Woodstock. Foot up your ass. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me break my foot up in your ass. <laughs> I gotta show you this one. It's so fucked up after the stream. But I think you gotta stream it. There's a man whose head resembles a... deodorant. <laughs> <laughs> That is pretty good. <laughs> Alright, Kenji, what do you need me to do now? I would like you to go pick up my order of dry when trouble moves, the fool turns and then my lunch faces it down. from Subway. <laughs> have ignored repeated requests do you remember those Saturday Night Live um, TV Funhouse uh, parodies that they would do? And they made yeah, fun of like, Bambi. <laughs> and they would rain, they randomly had Jared from the Seinfeld commercials teaming up with Bambi to, just, to defeat Al-Qaeda. That is so 2000s. And people were just like, holy shit, this aged like dog, or this aged like milk with Jared. <laughs> I'm pretty sure everything involving Jared aged like milk. So I believe I need to Ambiguously get a gay duo. I don't know that. You got, Basically the, the modern day Woodstock 99. From the makers of Bambi 2002. Or, um. Or a goofy movie 2002. And Polka Hot Ass. <laughs> It shows like a Native American getting gangbanged. Oh God, Custer's Revenge, the movie. The second you said the subway and Al Qaeda, that sounds two thousand. Yep. The Travis. Oh yeah, yeah, that is true though. The Travis Scott concert is basically uh, modern day Woodstock '99. Poke a hot ass. <laughs> I remember there was the other one where they were making fun of like Disney movies and be like in a hundred and one fellatios. Oh god. And you see like just a bunch like these two dudes in like Dalmatian makeup. Oh, god. <laughs> With some hooker. TV Funhouse is funny SNL shit. Yeah. yeah. Remember when Saturday Night Live was funny? Oh yeah. Uh, About see, 30 that. years ago. <laughs> oh, a Yardy. I'm sorry. I thought I had to steal a... It's that one with the hydraulics. Ah. Oh, there's one. Every casino American woman I've ever met has been a sloot. A sloot. A sloot. <laughs> Woo! Hydraulics, baby! Nice. Do you remember that one scene from uh, Bam, uh, Diva La Bam where they put hydraulics in his dad's van 
and they're like freaking oh. the fuck out. <laughs> that show is great. Oh, that scene where they ripped off Vito's. Ugh. Vito they're all was gagging. Vito. Yes, he was actually literally. Oh, his fucking toenail. Ugh. Yeah, they ripped his fucking toenail off. It was gross. Oh. The raggae in the station is fire. Love that album. Yes. Yeah. Game is really good music. Um, it just sucks. You can't play it on stream. Bummer, dude. Bummer. Cow a bummer. Cow a fucking piece of dog shit. <laughs> Kill all the Colombians. <laughs> like there was a mission in Vice City that just said kill all Haitians or something. Oh yeah, um, we had to play as um, what's it called? Uh, when you're playing as Tommy Versetti, you have to help uh, Cortez, not Cortez, uh, Diaz. Yeah, kill that Haitian dick. <laughs> <laughs> The 2003 Nightclub Five video? Is that the one where like they were doing pyrotechnics inside and it quickly caught on fire and like a hundred people died? Yeah, I think I've seen that one. That's pretty fucked up. People got mad at that mission. Yeah, yeah, I remember that controversy. I think no, even uh, um, what's it called? Oh my God, what's the like the ambassador to like Haiti? Made like a complaint to Rockstar. <laughs> We're like, yeah, no, can you like not do that? Please. Did you see that video of, um, it was a shimmer lit like a room full of f in his house. A what? Uh, your mic was kind of cutting out. A uh, streamer lit a uh, room full of fireworks. Like you lit it on fire. I think that's something like who's a fake room. I show speed. Yeah. Holy shit. Used to make good videos, now he's an Israel show. I, I, I show Speed's another one that lit off. <laughs> he set off a. It was bad. Yes, he caused the New York riot, or uh, almost a riot, because he said he was giving out PS5s. And people were like flocking away, like to him. Imagine rioting to get a system that has games. <laughs> I mean, it has a game, it has uh, Superman 2 on Blu ray. <laughs> Astros play world too. <laughs> Friends with I show sweet so it makes sense. <laughs> Can I get one of these cars? Yeah. Yeah. I like these names for the radio stations. Double Clef FM. That's the one that would always <laughs> play like the classic stuff. Yeah, the opera songs. And the other one, one was song like. I would always play in the trailers. <laughs> <laughs> I like the station that's nothing but uh, from Scar. Mm -hmm. Which would have made more what made more sense in the next game. You use the fake room apparently for that. Oh. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, it was fake and gay. So we can fake and gay. Imagine claiming you won a PS5 in a raffle. I did, dick. <laughs> Fucking dick, I did. I was like, that was either Fuzz or Joey. <laughs> nah, Fuzz would have bought it. Fuzz would have bought it, and he would have proud of it too. I bought that. I paid money for that. He would have um bought it so he could play uh, Google Stadia with it. <laughs> Yo, did you see that clip of fucking uh, Boogie Two Nine Eight Eight home from the bed? <laughs> no, please share that. <laughs> the medic showed it on us. Do you have an actual point? <laughs> One for me and one for my hooker. Oh, one yes! One for me and one for the hooker. <laughs> and he starts humping the fucking bed. <laughs> I was like, that's fuzz how I bought ga Stadia game. One for me and one for my hooker. <laughs> one for me and one for the hooker. <laughs> As he's like furiously <laughs> humping the bed. <laughs> he's like, oh yeah, oh yeah, Boogie, that was a lot of energy out of ya. Furiously, like, literally three thrust and he's tired. <laughs> that boogie stream was fucking great. Uh, I need to rewatch that again. <laughs> what for me? I am not spending four grand on a fucking PS5 signed by some no name stream.
Well, apparently he's not no name. He's getting fucking manhandled in fucking uh, Norway or whatever the. F <laughs> I still can't get over that video. It literally looks like some fucking third world thing, and they're just grabbing the the dictator out of his fucking palace. <laughs> so, tomorrow, hold on, this is what Richard said. Tomorrow, I'm going to see Boogie in a convention in South Carolina. Should I punch him? Um, no, no. Don't can punch. You, can you just say, um, <laughs> hey, hey, uh, how does it feel to be Medicare's bitch? <laughs> Please, if you can do a video of that. Yes. You go up to Boogie and go, one for me and one for the hooker. <laughs> one for one me, for me and, one... and one for a hooker. <laughs> or do something like, hey, can you say a shout out to my friend Fuzz? <laughs> shout out to my friend Mr. Medicaid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> do you have an actual point, Spurglord? I have a point. Fuzz House still won't hate me. He's afraid of me. What a little bitch. He'll bring my name up when... Yelling at fucking Gaseous, but he won't fucking debate me myself. He has me blocked on Discord. What a little bitch. Does he have Twitter? Has he blocked you on there? He's banned from Twitter. Actually, I think uh, he made a post and got banned for it. But he actually does have another Twitter account. The, um, God, what is it? That his, uh, tw loud is funny he has Twitter. Existing as a figure of ridicule is owning the troll. Oh, guys, I'm totally owning the trolls. Look at me. That nine-hour stock fiat stream, where it's just him getting dunked on by the entire Smegma Discord is great. Well, Bong flagged down Fuzzy's Twitter. Uh, sometimes Twitter will flag you. They have AI. Speaking of AI, you hear like... that shit going on with YouTube now? They're gonna... Uh, you, you can have the option of uh, getting rid of uh, AI videos of you if, you if you do not consent to it. Now, my thing is, people are gonna fucking flag, or they're gonna abuse that shit. They're gonna flag down any video of anything controversial they'll say, and just say, oh, that's yeah. just AI. Yeah, I can see that happening. Yeah. Here, guys, have a grenade. <laughs> hey, f hey, fuck ass, catch. <laughs> Get a grenade. Fetch the grenade! <laughs> Just yeets it at him. Huh? Boom! <laughs> <laughs> Imagine someone tosses you a grenade and you just catch it in your hand. Like, whoa! <laughs> Pop. Thanks, man! Mean Joe Green! Here, kid! <laughs> Here! Catch Rip this frog! Got his... <laughs> Rip Bong got his Twitch taken down. Oh, I think he blamed fuck. Oh my, what happened to your fuck? What happened to your Twitch account, man? I got you bot. So what? I got you bot. So what? Do you have a point? <laughs> What's your point? The point is, Fuzz, is that you're a spaz. Too afraid to debate me. He thinks he's so superior to me, but he won't have a fucking civil conversation with me. <laughs> Little blood sports. Little. Little bit of a bait. Someone's too bitch made to do it. How did he ban you? Um, you made a joke. And he's like, "Hey, hold on a minute. I gotta ban someone for chat." The chat. Yeah, because he was talking about something, and I was like, "That's a very pristine thing, Fuzz." <laughs> and very he banned you for that. What a fucking pristine. <laughs> he still he blocked me on fucking Discord. <laughs> Has he blocked you on Twitter now? That's the real question. Ah, uh, see, I think he... That, when he was reading at me... <laughs> oh yeah, he was, yeah, like, was... threatening to, like, copyright claim Gaseous's, uh, video. That is bitch made. And Gaseous was right, like, you got nothing to say with him now. No, fuck you. Yeah. Yeah, fuck off. I'm trying to be a false It's like both. It's like Boheepins. Little flaggot. Oh, our little Boheepins. Is he even still around? He does upload once in a while, but he gets like so he gets like no views now because he banned everyone from commenting commentating. Yeah. It's like okay, you little bitch. I just looked him up on YouTube and all I can find are the Medicare videos. Oh bad. Thank you, Viz, for giving me a good idea. Yes, um obviously yeah, do not 
you give him a, a, a sucker punch, but definitely be like, hey, can you give a shout out to my friend Fuzz? <laughs> he loves his Google. Can you sign my Google or my friend's Google Stadia for him? <laughs> one for can me you... and one for my hooker. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's fuzz. It's fuzz ordering DoorDash. And Manager oh. says hi. <laughs> One for me and one for my hooker. One for me and one for the hooker. <laughs> Welcome to the sub club. I will give you one last chance to prove my sister's faith in you. I didn't do shit, Kenji. Run these scumbags into the ground. Do shit. Shame in the rivers of our enemy's blood. Finish this on this stream. I don't know how far I can get. I'll probably get to like what about 50 more minutes, and then I'll call it a night. Yeah. But probably the next stream, definitely. Oh yeah. One for me and one for my hooker. <laughs> <laughs> I've been laughing at that all fuck. <laughs> I'll be laughing at work and be like, "Hey man, what, what you laughing at?" And be like, "Oh, nothing." <laughs> oh, something I saw on Leno night or whatever. I was about to say, yeah, there's still a little bit of game left. <laughs> welcome to the sub club. Ah, Buggy, welcome to the sub club. Ah, yeah, fuck your audience. <laughs> he was so pissed. Oh, like, I'd be rightfully, you know, rightfully so. Like, holy shit. Pretending like, you, you have cancer. You purposely buy one of those... Or get involved with those pump and dump schemes? Boogie, mm -hmm. go fuck yourself. He's like, oh, I needed it for cancer medication. And he's like, he ends up buying, like, diet medication, like that diabetes weight loss medication for it. Oh. Woo, Boogie, look at you. If stapling a stomach shut didn't do it, then the fucking medication isn't gonna do it either. I know, he's still fat as fuck. In fact, he's even fatter since that procedure. Yeah. Looking weeaboo later on, no one doctor disrespects Claude. <laughs> <laughs> it is imperative that you uh, do not show weakness in front of your enemy. <laughs> I got a good recommendation for a game you can play on stream. Saints Row 2. That game is fucking great. Yeah, Saints Row 2 is, uh, that's hotly right. Consider it done. Curly fries and hippo lard can't get in. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> there goes my driving again. Oh, dear. Ask me how my driving is. Uh, it is currently on fire. Oh dear. Yeah, they, they, those fast cars don't take long. Saints Row Reboot is destroying Embracer. I got that game for free from Sony and I didn't really play it. I've been meaning to play it on stream, actually. You know what? That's a good idea. After I'm done Sly Cooper, I can do a stream of uh, Saints Row. The Reboot. <laughs> How's my driving? It reminds me from uh, Scary Movie 2. How's my driving? 1-800-KISS-MY-ASS. <laughs> Let me go use my good hand. No! Use my strong hand! Time Splitters 4 never... Ooh, that one's painful. You know, someone actually... Uh, oh, oh, you passed the mission. Nice. They um, made a K rebate, uh, remaster of Time Splitters 2. And they hit it in another game. Oh, yeah. If you buy, I think it's called Home the Revolution, there's an arcade machine that has time splitters too in there. And if you input a button command, you can actually unlock the whole game. Gearbox, Saber Interactive, that are dirt cheap for the cost they bought them in the first. Ow. I wonder how dirty that fucking bathroom would be. Mm. A bathroom in the middle of like Central Park. Oh, that's filthy. Real fucking filthy. 
where you buy. Phil Not even the rats would live in there. The nope. Phil Swift. Super strong water tight uh -huh. adhesive. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Beat you, Torsh. <laughs> <laughs> Slap it on with the might of Zeus. It's not a miracle product. <laughs> I watched those videos at least once. Fucking flex tape videos. How's uh, John Tron been? I haven't really uh, heard too much from him recently. Um, he makes enough that he can only up uh, that he only really has one or two videos a year, and it still gets like m millions of views the day it uploads. Gotcha. But. He's doing miss, real good. I miss when he would do video game stuff. Oh yeah, those are great. So it's fine. Too. Yeah, it's a. Yep. He went from being like a video game guy, movie reviewer. Now it's just whatever the fuck catches his fancy. Dan Aykroyd vodka? Why not? <laughs> and, and Dan Aykroyd is fucking insane. <laughs> He really is. Uh, Dan Aykroyd is what would happen if Chris Bors became a successful actor. Holy shit. Gorilla mindset. Le legal mindset? Legal mindset looks like Randy Bitchford. It just... I just remember Ethan Ralph. Ugh. Legal mindset. Oh my... Bish. Every time I hear... LEGAL MINDSET! <laughs> <laughs> Send Dan Aykroyd a Sonic Chew medallion! <laughs> yes! Chris Bors wants a Sonic Chew medallion. Yeah, but he doesn't want, want it Chris... at his house. <laughs> <laughs> I want Chris Bors to be like the Warrens. Of... Do you know who the Warrens are? Uh, I, I think I do. They were uh, paranormal investigators. 70s. Conjuring movies were based on. Ah. That's that's gonna be Chris Bors. He's just gonna like around collecting all these ancient art from internet blogs. Like the Sonichu medallion, Oof. Ralph's Papa's ring. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, I bit the dust. Oof. I got felted. Jolted. That should be the next one, Felton. No, uh, what's his name? He doesn't really comment as much. Uh, Guab, was it Guabo? He made a. Remember when? Um, Guapo, yeah. When uh, you were streaming Life is Strange two, or no, yeah. Life is Strange one, and uh, what's her name gets bitch slapped by the dad, and he yeah. goes patrolled. Yes, that was great. The irate gamers laughing at me. Get my maker's mark. Josh Moon's penis, bitch. I don't. F Gator, bish. Play the clip, Gator. Play the clip, bish. And speaking of fucking cringe, uh, Gator, what the fuck, buddy? <laughs> yeah, dude. Shannon Gaines. It's like, hey, but hey, girl, remember me? It's like, and the girl's like, yeah, I kind of remember you, unfortunately. <laughs> that's that. That's a good sign that someone. That clip was really hard. Cringe. <laughs> oh. That hurt. Here, have some grenades. You know what? Have a few grenades. Have a handful. Steal the tank after the mission is pushing it into your gr Takes forever, though. Ooh. Oh, God! I'm on fire! I'm on fire! This plot is on fire and getting shotgun. <laughs> They threw a Molotov cocktail at me. Just take the tank and drive it over there. You're right. Come on, don't die, don't die. It won't let me. Oh, why was I sh aim? Why would it give me the option to aim? It shoot Phil Cassidy. Why would it do uh, that? <laughs> I thought I was aiming at one of the Colombians. It's locked. <laughs> it locked. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm sorry. Fuck. You take the tank. And then he aims it at the guy he's supposed to help. Oh. Here, I'm that I'm was a one of the bad guys. disaster. Z disaster. <laughs> Push it to your garage in the door box. <laughs> I can't believe that happened. Hey, hold 
Flex tape. <laughs> Flex tape can't keep my ins <laughs> inside. Without Flex that, who needs that? <laughs> I'm sorry, Ray, as he's bleeding out. <laughs> Holy shit, that was funny as hell. That was good. I mean, to be honest, I was probably gonna die anyway, so. Actually, here. I'm gonna block the entry. Ah, I can't get the vehicle. That sucks. Damn it. Timmy! Timmy! Julie! Julie! Oh, God. Julie! <laughs> Ray phoned ahead, but I thought there'd be more of you. Can't believe those yellow belly Fourth backs. Of Fourth of Julie! <laughs> uh, Fourth of Julie! Grab whatever you need. Those Columbians oh, my mommy and I. <laughs> Family guy! That video is so creepy. It's like Christian and like this cheap talking about taking like Julie or Ivy on a date. Oh, God. And his date is just, we're gonna go to my heart and I'll have. We're gonna have uh, my sex time, of course. We're gonna have the Hank. And, and then we we're go. gonna watch the Family Guy and play the Guitar Hero. Pickle Man tricked me again, but they're in the step name. <laughs> You don't have to tell me twice, but in the Stone Age. <laughs> you want the chainsaw, Gringo? I always remember that one. You want the AK-47, Gringo? <laughs> See. See, senor. Oh god, oh god, I need, I need body armor. Woo! <laughs> oh boy. Go and check on Phil. Hell yeah, hey, Phil. Up with you Maybe I Phil have Burnell. If you need any firepower, <laughs> just drop by and take what you need. I can be good at video games. <laughs> imagine, oh. imagine you're like in a shootout and Phil Burnell side Phil is your fucking backup. <laughs> wow, well, okay. You'd be better off with a fucking stormtrooper. Right? At least eventually they'll hit something. Wow. I think, uh, who was it? Gassy said if you hit the damage the door, it'll open. Hmm. Let's give that a try, shall we? A college try. A good college try. Open sesame. Huh. Open sesame. <laughs> open tank -me. Can I punch it? Knock, knock. Nope. <laughs> Fucked up. Hey, fucking bug mechanic. Don't you have a bat? I, bug tanks me. Unfortunately, I do not has a bat. <laughs> Try to punch the tank. Like you're fucking super. <laughs> I'm, I'm on PCP, baby. <laughs> <laughs> it takes a while. It tanks a while. It tanks a while, yeah. You could just do the cheat too and just summon. <laughs> That too. We're not doing it that way. We're doing it legit. We're doing it the old school way before we had computers. I hear that one guy keep driving like that asshole. <laughs> You're just knocking everything out of your way. I'm like a killdozer. Ah! That's a real patriot right there. Oh yeah, that was awesome. If you don't like my driving, get off the sidewalk. <laughs> tell, don't tell, tell me, me how to drive. drive. <laughs> That's good. Oh, Spoonie. Uh, Spoonie, Spoonie. Don't tell me how to play. <laughs> Stop backseating. Stop backseating. Uh. Dude, I think this is a good spot, though, to call it a night. Dude, that was fun. That was a good stream. I didn't think I could top the last one when we first started playing GTA last week. But, man, this one, this one takes This one game. was good. This one. More like Snoopy. <laughs> <laughs>
That was good. But anyways, Boopy. um, Richard, Gassius, Torsh, uh, D-Man, uh, Richard, and everyone else that uh, hopped on the stream tonight. Thank you for stopping by. And Joey, thank you for co-streaming as always, buddy. Oh, it's been my pleasure. This stream was great, and thank you guys for watching. Oh, yeah. Until then, this is Mr. Viz and Joey JoJo signing off. You all have an amazing night, and hope you all had a good 4th of July. Later.